Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Whew, okay. Cancer, it's your turn. We're gonna throw down your cards for the month of April. I know it's like way late and I am so super sorry. It was another one of those months, you know. Life happened repeatedly over and over again. Not to my advantage or benefit, but we're still, we're kicking and we're rolling through it. So I'm gonna skip the the sob story and just get right to throwing down your cards. So this reading will be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for April 2021. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can be, but vice versa. It might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Friday Sign Tarot Table. Everybody's always welcome here. I love it when you guys stop by. I appreciate you stopping by. While you're here, if you want to hit the like button or subscribe or the notification bell, that'd be great. If not, that's okay. I mean, I'm not going to twist your arm or force you to do anything you don't want to do. That's not what we do here. We encourage people to live their positive life. Positive vibes only. Do what's best for you. Know what I'm saying? Okay, anywho, before I do the invocation and throw your cards down, two quick things. One, never make any life-altering decisions based on a tarot reading. It's just not a good practice to get into. I mean, I read tarot, and I would never do that. Seriously. Two, it's not your story, not your reading, not your message. Leave the cards on the table and walk away. It's not going to be your message every time. It's just not. I can't pull that kind of um, energy out of the universe. And based on, you know, where the stars were aligned when people were born, and it's just, you know, people have different energies because they're controlled by different forces and different planets and different stars, and I'm not going to get too far into the astrology lesson. So, Heavenly Father, Mother of the Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. April 2021. Thanks for coming and hanging out with us today. Let's bring Cancer to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Cancer, why are you here? The star. Could be an Aquarius you're dealing with. That's amazing. That's like dream come true fairy tale stuff. I got all kinds of positive vibes coming off of that. All right, well. Oh, 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 gosh. That's amazing. Cancer, that's amazing. Death and the Hanged Man. That is change on a soul level from acceptance of something that you had no control over. That's freaking beautiful. I'm going to clarify it, but I'm getting nothing but positive vibes off of that. For real. All right. Going on right now. Eight of Cups. Moving forward. Walking away from Eight Cups. Some of them spilled. Some of them still full. Either way, you're walking away. What's this? Can't really tell what's in that or what it is. Just this weird thing at the bottom of the card. Anyway. Eight of Cups is not a bad card. No. You're going off on a journey. Because you got two more cups to look for. I mean, okay. Either way. The cycles come to an end, so old cycles have ended, new cycles have began, you've accepted things you had no control over, you got nothing but positive vibes coming with you. What's what's coming in for you, Cancer? Hermit reverse nine of pentacles. I'm not sure what's up with that hermit reverse, but that nine of pentacles isn't bad. That's sketchy. That hermit reversed is sketchy. 
to me, it kind of means burying your head in the sand about something, like ignoring an issue. The star talks about healing. Healing is a process. It does not happen overnight. Mm, okay. What's the bottom have to say? Two of cups. Yup. Seven of swords reversed. Death cycle, old cycles ending, new cycles beginning, two of cups. It was new. It was different. It was fresh. I mean, it's the minor arcana lovers. Mm. Mm, I got to get clarity. There's only two people in the car. This had something to do with love. Seven of swords reversed on top of the hangman. Trudes came out. Yeah. Yeah. We have clarity here in a second. What's that Eight of Cups? Two of Wands reversed. Can't let go, can't move on. The other person you're dealing with might have, be having a hard time letting go. Hermit reversed, sun reversed. Accepting the things you cannot change. Accepting things you have no control over. Truths is being spoken. Things coming out. Some of you might be at a crossroads about moving on. Possibly because you haven't completely healed yet. Hermit reverse, sun reversed. You're not healing. You're not going to find the sunshine. There's something we got to do in here. Something's got to be done in here. To get to this Nine of Pentacles. What's up with the Nine of Pentacles? Knight of Pentacles reversed. Mm. Is that what that's all about? Is that, is that what's up with that? I'd rather be alone. I don't need your pentacle. That's not healing. I mean, if it works for you, great. But that's not healing. That's ignoring a problem. Do what you want. It's not my journey. Because sometimes when, when this is in the upright, it's fabulous. He's got a pentacle. Pentacles represent abundance. Pentacles represent what you want. He's not quite the catch, but he's not very far off. Just saying. This nine of pentacles here. I mean, I love her to death. I really do. Sometimes she can be a little bit jaded. Occasionally. But, you know, she's self-sufficient. But at the same time, she's stubborn. Okay, let's get some clarity. Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for Cancer, please? Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, April 2021. Cards on the table for Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. 
April 2021. Ow! Just clawed myself in the forehead. It happens. I don't know if you guys can see this, this little dent in my forehead. So funny. It was like a few weeks ago now. I was at work. I went to get something out of my car. I can't remember what it was, but the sun was just in my eyes that right. Just right. And I had a mask on, so I couldn't tell how close I was to the car when I opened the door forcibly and whacked myself in the skull with it. It was terrible. It was bleeding all over. Probably should have gone and gotten stitches, but I didn't. Anyway, I, I always find it amusing when I whack myself in the forehead now. Anyway, enough about me. Cards on the table for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Ten of Wands. Next to the star. Dropping your sticks off. Releasing of burdens. Your healing. Ending of a burdensome cycle. Okay. That's not bad. It's not bad. Why is death here? Seven of Wands reversed. Eight of Cups and the High Priestess. Hmm. Used your intuition. Again with the moving on. Not fighting the cycle. Using your intuition in regards to this death cycle. Perhaps there was huge differences between you, and that's why one of you is moving on. That's why this is happening. The High Priestess is in the upright, not in the reverse. I keep hearing ego. It might apply to some of you, but not all of you. Why is the Two of Cups here? Six of Pentacles. Why the Six of Pentacles? Oh my goodness. Three of Cups, Ace of Cups. I'm afraid. Page of Pentacles. Somebody got put in the friend zone. Things been stagnant. Somebody got put in the friend zone. Somebody got put in the friend zone. Somebody else moved on. Death cycle. Change. Okay. It's not a bad thing. Y'all decided you just want to be friends. Why is it a bad thing? You know, the cup of friendship is not a, a you know... Not a bad cop. Friendships last longer than other certain offers. Let me tell you. Mm. Why is the hangman here? Why the hangman? Hi. It's swords.
Oh, okay, so that acceptance didn't come right away, did it? Why the Eight of Swords? King of Pentacles. Why the Seven of Swords reversed? Magician. Why the Magician? The Fool. Hmm. New, new, new. That's why you accepted it. What well, it was. It was a short road to acceptance, wasn't it? Yeah. They were the major catch. You struggled with it for a minute. Truths came up about something. Decided to go off. Manifest new things, new journeys. Okay, fine. Fine. Why the Eight of Cups? You. Chariot reversed. Five pentacles reversed. I don't like the friend zone. Been a long cold winter. These pentacles are barely hanging on. You moved on from this. They may have tried to prevent you from moving on. Why the two of wands reversed? You're in the process of moving on from this. Some of you um, may be. Having your process interrupted. Why the two of wands reversed? Knight of Cups. I still hold a cup for you. Do what you want. If you want to move on from this, do what you want. Wait for me. Why is the hermit reversed here? The star. Hmm. Landed cockeyed, kind of in the reverse. So I'm going to take it in the reverse. Hermit reversed, star, temperance in the reverse. Oh, friends. Okay. Um, healing's a process. I think you're going to try to show the world that you're healed, but you're not. There's still negative energy here. Faux show. Sun reversed. A soulmate connection that not, is not equal. Not equally felt. By the sun reversed. Hangman reversed. Somebody's still hung up. Somebody's not accepting. Empress reversed. Not accepting that it didn't grow. Not accepting that they didn't get their empress. Oh my. Somebody did not appreciate getting friend zoned. A 
Somebody needs to be blessed being friend zoned. Just saying. You know how hard it is to get in my friend zone? Or stay in my friend zone? Get back into my friend zone? <laughs> 10, 10, 15 years ago, that was impossible. I've grown and changed as a person. I turned 40, but neither here nor there. Two cups reversed. Was not meant to be. It's not meant to be. Two cups upright, two cups reversed. Somebody's going to struggle with that, and they're going to make you try to struggle with it. It caused some bad blood and some bad energy cause you to not want to deal with anybody. Don't, don't let somebody do that to you. Don't let somebody screw with your energy like that. Release this burden. Allow, allow for the sun, allow for your healing, allow for the sun to shine in your life. Don't let somebody screw with your energy like that. Why is the nine of pentacles here? Five of wands. Mm. Oh gosh. Come to me. <laughs> What's up with that? Queen of Wands. She enjoys the freedom that Queen of Wands does. She does. Has a tendency to be a bit confrontational. A lot of fire energy there. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Fire signs enjoy their freedom. You could be dealing with a fire sign. I don't know. You could have fire in your chart. That independent streak could come off as a little bit too fiery for some people. Don't let that happen. Or do what you want. I mean, it's your journey. Why is the Knight of Pentacles reversed here? Karma. Judgment. Oof. Oof. <laughs> One more, please. Hi, thanks. Page ones. I'm sensing a little bit of a fair commitment here. I really am. I think commitment scared you a little bit. I think commitment scared them a little bit. Until it came down to, oh my gosh... I'm going to lose cancer if I don't pull my head out of my rear end. That's what it came down to. Hmm. Very interesting, cancer. Very interesting. Let's get your advice. I just see this turning into some kind of weird spiral to a fear of commitment. I mean, you're moving on to go find your cups of happiness, but you're avoiding your cups of happiness. You're avoiding st stability for fun, which that's all well and good. But it's almost you're doing it out of spite. And that's the part that's bothersome for me. Do what you want. I'm not judging. Live your best life your way. Just understand that there's repercussions to that. Page Pentacles reversed, Emperor reversed.
if you shut out the small stable offers, you're not going get to the, get the stability you crave. The Devil and the Six of Swords. It might benefit you to disconnect from the toxic energies and the toxic residue from whatever this was and move forward from it. And I know you think you are, but I don't think you are. There's, you're still going to be carrying negative energy, according to these cards. The temperance is reversed. That hermit is reversed. That star is upright. I call that a false healing. It's not a real healing. What you want is this. And you're so close. What you want is a healing and a release of that burden. Nine of Cups, Seven of Swords. Fill your cups with positive things in positive ways. And as for our buddy, Mr. Swords, mm, be wary of Mr. Swords because Mr. Swords, he just wants to come back for what he thinks is his. He stole it to begin with. See, he's got five swords in his bag. He left two swords behind. Don't let him take what doesn't belong to him or her. Insert pronoun wherever you need to. Okay? <laughs> Don't let somebody mess with your energy. You have to stick positive. Ace of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. You can have your cake and eat it too. You can. I see good things coming for you. As soon as you put down those 10 sticks, you get to pick up this one. And that's a new journey of fun and excitement. And oh gosh, it's sitting next to this guy and he's carrying a pentacle. You want the pentacle, okay? You want the bliss. You want the joy. You want the big brick house with the white picket fence and the 2.5 kids and the dog in the pool and the nice car out front and the big porch out back where you can sit and sip lemonade and watch sunset. The kids playing out in the yard, catching fireflies if that's what you want for your life. I mean, you run that. That would be my bliss. Just saying. Cancer, I love you. Thank you so much for your patience. Thanks for stopping by. I'm going to get out of here because I have to be up at stupid o'clock in the morning for the bread and butter job. So I'm going to try to get some sleep. I love you. Enjoy the rest of your April. I'll catch you guys next week for your May reads. Take care. See you soon.